Hi, my name is Aditi and I'm entering the Code Young contest. My project is a game. This game <clears throat> has a trash can, water bottles, and styrofoam. It, this explains that you should, recycling is a big impact on global warming. If you don't recycle, it can cause a lot of problems. So always remember to recycle and recycle in the right place. Don't recycle styrofoam. Let's start. Now, this is the game. So, as you can see, how, why did I lose? Because the styrofoam went right into my trash can. Styrofoam is something that should not be recycled, so choose the right ones, like water bottles. And the goal of the game is to stay on for 10 seconds. As you can see, it is pretty hard if you want to earn a lot of points. So, let's make it a little bit shorter for us to show you, for me to show you today. Let's decrease it to three seconds. So, you win. It'll say you win if you manage to go through those 10 seconds, which I'll change later. Now, click on the objects. So, this is my project. Now let me explain you a little bit about the code. So, when green flag clicked, I, when, I, when the trash can started, I didn't want to tell it which place to go. I wanted to pick random between these, this area. <coughs> so I put pick random between 162 and 184. And then my variable is set score. You might have not seen it on the video, but I, I will show you a little bit later. So each time, um, so we want to set our score to zero. So every time um, we click on the green flag, it sets to zero. It starts again. Now, if touching the water bottles, each time the score should increase, so we put it in a forever block. And play sound pop is just for fun. This, um, this piece of code right here tells to click the right arrow and the left arrow to move our trash can. This, this um, is telling of uh, this one, um, talks about our donut. Our donut is actually has another costume, which was the styrofoam. And if it touches the styrofoam, it changes back drum to you lose, plays boom cloud, which is a bad sound, and sets time pass to zero. We put stop this script so no other backgrounds can come at the time. So the reason why we put time pass is for our timer. Because our timer didn't work, we set it with a variable. And every and it'll count at the, at the same 10 seconds. And this is our code for the timer here. If timer passed equals three, then hide. If it goes more than three, meaning, then you should hide, broadcast hide. So every other sprite hides during this time and broadcast reveal to this background and all of the objects too. And the code for each water bottle is telling to go in any random position from up to down. From You have to change, it's the same x but a different y for each water bottle so we want to make each one go different if we put everything as minus 10 then it'll all go the same way so some can be minus 7 minus 10 and different ones and the y if the y position is less than 100 minus 170 then it should go to a random position over and over it's in a loop and for the styrofoam we have Switch costume to this because it was a, in the, the same sprite. Go to random position just like the water bottles. And finally, we have these objects. All I had to do for this was put one sprite clicked and appear. And for our earth here, I put switch costumes after each saying. Thank you for listening. I hope you liked it.